What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back to y'all again with another art video, man. If you're new to this channel, go ahead, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, make sure you click post notifications so you'll be notified every time your boy drops some heat. In today's video, I will be working on a logo for a friend of mine, and the logo name is called Cash Cow, man. All about that money. And another thing too, man, if you haven't already, go ahead and follow me on Spotify at Chi World because I got a lot of music coming soon. So y'all make sure you go ahead and get on the early curve of that. So let's jump right into this video though, man. I'm finna set my pressure to my pen. Go down here, trying to eat two numbers to three. You feel me? And you gotta have a digital art tablet to be able to get the pressure options. I just gotta make sure I say that on every video. Cause I know somebody gonna ask me, man, how you get the how you get the pressure option? You need a digital art tablet where you can be able to do it with your pen. Alright. First thing I like to do, drop the opacity down. Now let's start. I'm finna come up. So what I did was I went to Google and I just downloaded pictures of a real cow. So I can see how cows look. So what I'm gonna do is I'm looking at a reference, but I'm finna turn the cow into like a cartoon style, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going off the a real picture though. So it's gonna take a lot of creativity, but also we trying to keep keep it looking like a cow at the same time. So I'm gonna go ahead and get us get the face of the facial. I said facial, the facial features of the cow. You know what I'm saying? I know he said he wanted the cow to have like a gold grill. So, let me make one side. I just might come up like that. Look at that. I know the cow's got that big top lip. Got that big old nose. So let's do it like that. Also, we're gonna get this cast some eyebrows. I know this on his reference. He got it. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what I'm looking at so y'all can see. A lot of times when I'm doing like custom logos and stuff for a customer, what I do is I get them to give me a sketch so I can see what their ideas are and then I can take it from there and try to, you know what I'm saying, bring it to life for them. But I can just automatically see the direction they wanted to take the picture. So that's why I make sure I get all my clients to send me a rough sketch, even if you can't can't draw. I just need to see what your where your mind is so I know where to take it. Okay. Let me see. Okay, bring this like this. Okay, cool. So that's what he sent me. And that's all I needed. I just need to see what his ideas are. And then I'll take, take that little reference. And then I'll be like, okay, I see what you was thinking. And I know where I'm gonna take it. So. So. He said he wanted to have like a, a little 
hatch over his eye. So let's do it like that. Okay, cool, cool. Cool is good, man. I'm thinking, should I make these eyes? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make them round, bro. eyebrows a little more mean and confident so like this okay okay Y'all gotta bear with you, buddy. They, if I gotta hear it, y'all gotta hear it. Same like the proportion it was in. Let me highlight all this. Make sure I ain't missing it. Bring it down, son. Very cool. Let's fit it right there. Now what I want to do? Lock that layer. Go to my ticks. We're going to call it cash. Put my, put my caps lock on. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna 
drop the opacity. Yeah. Drop the opacity on that. Okay. Go back to my cow. Just make the cow a little bigger. This a money symbol is so we gonna do all that. So all we gotta do is go ahead and go to our uh, back to our front. Put the word cow. We also got our cow. I think I'm gonna make my cow head a little wider so it'll be more of a focal point. Anytime I make logos like this, I try to keep in mind like dang what how how would this look like on a necklace? I always try to see it as a visualize it being on something. So every time I make a logo, I go into it with that approach, like trying to picture it on something. Okay. Now I got a good, I got a good little reference out. Now it's time to do the line work, man. So first thing I'm gonna start it, start with is this, is this mouth. Let's make our Breast size of three point. Okay. Make sure I got a three point. So we can have some bold lines going on. Everything gonna be bold. Okay, do the cow nose. Process, man. Okay. Ready to put that grill in there, ma. Put them gold. Them gold teeth in there, ma, man. Okay. Cool. Right, that 
go hanging out like this. some bags on his eye uh, too like you know what I'm saying like your boy just been like the cows just been cows just been grinding you know what I'm saying he just been grinding bro you feel me I made this thing look dope. Okay. Now what we need to do, we need to go add these, uh, I'm gonna have a smoke cone behind his head. Add these ears. Looking. See how we looking. 
You know what? I can drop his nose down some. That's what we gonna do. Just drop this down just a little bit. So, go to expand the pants. Then I'm gonna go to my Pathfinder, click merge. And we gonna pull it down some. Still trying to give him the give him the cow look, man. Gotta make sure we're making it look like a cow. We don't want people to mistake it with a a donkey or something. Reflect. There we go. Got this thing looking good, man. Got this thing looking good, man. Okay. Bring this up. Do a cow got oh I don't think a cow got horns. If I'm not mistaken. Or it's just a bull do only the bulls got. Okay. I'm going to some fur to make it look Get some texture. Very 
quit so we can focus. Get everything out of the way. So we can focus on this area. We just add in a little the details and the facial features. Things, but it kind of experience life. Bring this down some. Tool. I want to do some shading with my pencil tool. Get some dark shadows out of the way. Using my pencil tool. Anytime you trying to create some logos and all that, you got to use your imagination, man. That's all I be doing. That's cool. Super cool. So, I don't know. Once we once we start coloring this it's really gonna bring this uh this entire picture out. It's gonna look like something then. Let's get everything, everything together for the coloring process. Too. I'm gonna slowly go around my entire picture to make sure everything closed off. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't got no openings. I'm gonna get this outline, some texture, some hair texture, something like that. Zoom in closer. Make sure. Oh, this closed off. Just like that. Here. 
で slowly putting this picture together man it's a process but when you want something to come out dope you gotta take your time Just gonna keep the uh, the shading. We are gonna keep it like two tones of color. So it's gonna be the base color and one shadow color to each color. So I like to try to keep it simple when you're doing logos. You don't want too much going on as far as like the color, the color scheme. There you have it, man. Nice little rough sketch. I mean, the line work. I'm talking about rough sketch. Got some smooth line work. You gotta start taking. Make sure you take your time on all your stuff, man. Chill, man. Bull look like, man, I don't care about nothing. I mean, this cow. Okay. So make sure we got a nice little bowl outline around his head. Cool. 
cool. Oh, with this. Still need to finish this cigar. Let's put a shadow. Right there. Okay. Let's work on this bell. Super cool, man. Okay. Move my brush size up to a one point three. I just want to draw the necklace. We got that thing going, man. Super dope logo. And, um, my brush bag small.
And there you have it, you guys. A super duper fire logo, man. You know what I'm saying? Thank you guys for watching. You know what I'm saying? I always appreciate it. Make sure you hit that link in the description if you want to check out and go ahead and follow me on Spotify, man, if you can. You know what I'm saying? Because I promise you, I will be dropping a lot of a lot of new music this year. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of music getting mixed as we speak. Thank you guys for watching, man. Make sure you stay tuned. More heat coming soon. And I'm out this thing.